What's up YouTube? Welcome back to another short video. So I'm in this, my 2014 Ford Escape. And uh, I had a check engine light come on when I would do the remote start. This is a titanium trim with push button start and uh, remote start as well. So the two check engine light codes came on. The DTC code was P025A, which says fuel pump. Module control circuit open, confirmed. The second one was U0109, lost communication with fuel pump control module. So basically, I had my mechanic friend uh, replace the this fuel pump control module or fuel pump driver control module or driver fuel pump control module. So... Came in this box from Ford dealership. It's like a two by four, cut at four inches. Fits in your hand, almost. And inside was this fuel pump control module that I purchased for around $30 and change from uh, Ford dealership. So in this video, I'm just gonna show you the location of this fuel pump control module on this 2014 Ford Escape. So to give you guys a perspective, I'm in this driver's seat and I'm gonna step out of the vehicle. This would be your front of the vehicle. And then we're gonna come to this passenger side. And this is your passenger side rear door. We're gonna go ahead and open this passenger side rear door. And passenger rear seat right over here. And the mechanic said your fuel pump control module, he goes, it's right under this floor carpet. It's located basically right here. Um, since I didn't replace it myself, I can't point exactly where it is. I'm assuming it has to be right over here kind of under the seat, under this carpet. So to access it, you're gonna have to remove this door uh, panel trim, plastic. This one here snaps out, comes right off. And then you would have to pull up the carpet somewhat to get to it. And you can replace that fuel pump control module yourself. It's $30 and change as of September 2018 at Ford dealerships at the moment. Now, replacing it didn't fix my problem. It was airbag related, so uh, it's fixed now. But if you have to replace your bad fuel pump control module, uh, this shows you where it is located. So good luck with this and take care.